Hey, it's me, GV, and oh man, this is weird. Uh, <laughs> welcome back to Let's Play Fallout New Vegas, ladies and gents. No, in fact, I'll do you one better. Let's 100% Fallout New Vegas. Um, yeah, I have a weird injury that's slowly going away, and some of you may know this already, but, um, uh, basically sitting down for long periods of time seems to exasperate it. Uh, so, I changed up my recording slash streaming situation, and god, hopefully it works. Uh, I'm gonna put a picture up of what that looks like. Um, it's, so basically I'm on a bed, uh, you know, lying straight, trying to record with my neck crooked at a weird angle. And, uh, yeah, so if you notice any inconsistencies with how I'm talking or anything like that, that's why. Um, yeah, I've been sitting for, you know, long periods of time recording, uh, and also doing streams, and it just seems to exasperate the injury, and it causes it not to heal fully, so, we're gonna roll with this, uh, basically, as long as possible, until this dumbass injury heals, it's been so annoying, but anyways, Welcome back, ladies and gents. Uh, we are going to be taking these drained micro microfusion cells. As many people have pointed out, uh, yeah, you can take the empty cases and, you know, uh, use them to make new ammo. I never did pretty much anything with the crafting, which is why you're probably going to see a lot of, you know, uh, just inconsistencies with not using the crafting systems, the ammo systems, everything like that. So, uh, we'll try to get them done in this uh, series, though. You know, I want to take the criticisms y'all are giving me and... You know, work on them. Uh, let's take a look. What were we doing? Let's see. They went that away. Find out from Manny Vargas where the cons were headed. Find the men who tried to kill you. Which reminds me. Uh, let's go back to Novak. Which reminds me, yeah. Um, somebody mentioned what the accent I'm doing is from. And, and yeah, that's who I'm channeling. It's Arthur from Red Dead Redemption 2. I couldn't remember what that voice sounded like to me so much so and it was yeah it's indeed arthur's sort of weird southern drawl from red dead redemption 2 which i which i freaking love by the way i really 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 enjoy his um his uh, accent okay let's take a look at this quest shall we we're doing they went that away find out from manny vargas where the cons were headed find the men who tried to kill you i already read that so i don't know why i did it again but basically, yeah, we need to talk to good old Manny Vargas here, uh, now that we've cleared out Repcon and figure out where we should go next. You have any luck with the ghouls? I'm counting on you. The ghouls are no longer at Repcon. Really? Unbelievable, man. I knew that wasn't gonna be easy. But I had a good feeling about you. You look like you've been through a lot. Now about the man I'm looking for. Okay, I'll tell you everything I know, like I promised. The guy you're looking for, Benny, he was traveling with some members from my old gang. They were going to Boulder City. Any idea why they went that way? No clue. I know Benny hadn't paid up yet. Maybe that was where they were supposed to get square. Where's Boulder City? It's in Colorado, you dingus. It's straight up Route 93 from here. Just keep following the road north. That's all I needed to know. Hope that helps. I owed you. So you were in a gang? Were they tough? Were they tough? I was in the cons, man. It doesn't get any badder. The cons are not even intimidating. They're silly. What was your tour with the NCR like? Oh, it was great. I wouldn't trade it. Something about that lifestyle, the discipline, seeing new places, making people safe. What's not to like? So why'd you leave? Uh, well, I just felt like it was time, you know? Wanted to have a home. Plus, I was up at Camp Golf when Bitter Springs went down. I faked like I was sick to get out of going because I knew some of the people there. But when everybody came back, nobody would tell me what happened, and people would call us murderers sometimes when we showed up to secure towns. What did happen at Bitter Springs? I still don't know exactly. Just that a lot of people died who didn't want to be a part of the fighting at all. I don't blame anybody for it. There's so much chaos when you're fighting. You're lucky not to shoot your own guys. But it did take something out of it for me. This wasn't the same. So when it came time to re-enlist, I just took my papers and walked. Well, we went through the rest of his dialogue. Why not finish it out? What do you do to protect... What, what, eh? what, what do you protect your town from? You name it. Anything that comes within a thousand yards that looks like trouble. Lately, we've been getting ghouls. Coming from the road to Repcon out to the west. Quite a few last couple days. The big threat is the Legion coming from the east. If they decide to attack with a full force, they'll run us over. But so far, we've been lucky. Okay, so we know everything about good old Manny Vargas now. Goodbye! Yeah, see ya. Boone don't give no shits. 
Novak Idolize, renowned for your extensive support and goodwill. You are idolized by the community. Wonderful. Thanks, buddy. Like I said, you can just pickpocket him to get the holo tape if you so wish. I love this game because it gives you so many different options. It's freaking awesome. I just realized that I did not set up my phone to know how long I've been recording. Well, we'll just we'll just go as long as I think then, I I guess. Somebody said something, by the way, about, like, a tent and getting a... But they said in Nipton, or did they say Novak? I feel like they said Nipton. There's a tent over here, but I don't remember getting any quests from... What do we have? Hi. Novak Settler. We ain't gonna get no quests from them. Got a Brahm in there. Yeah, I guess they said Nipton, but there's nobody in Nipton, right? I don't know. Uh, anyways, there is a quest that we uh, missed out on. We're gonna hold off on the main quest for now. We're gonna go back to the NCR Correctional Facility. A lot of people were saying that we're locked out of this quest, but I don't actually think that we are. I think we'll be fine. Uh, let's give it a shot, though. Um, we're gonna go in here, and we're gonna go back to talk to Eddie. As I said, if I missed anything, feel free to let me know, and I'll do my best in order to... Never gets old when something blows up. What did you say to me? That's what I thought. You don't even look like a powder ganger, silly boy. Uh, we're gonna go to, uh, yeah, we're gonna go talk to Eddie again and get that quest. Uh, I was worried that we'd have to stick with being a bad guy, but it doesn't seem like that's the case. Now, I, do, I legitimately don't even know if I've ever done this quest before. Like I said, in my, uh, before my YouTube and days, I would always look up lists of everything and make sure I completed literally everything, so I don't know why I would have missed this one, but, nevertheless... Uh, can we just go in and talk to the guy? Let's... Oh, yeah, there's no, like, quick saving. So we're gonna make a new save here real quick. Thank you very much. Now, where was Eddie? You're not Eddie. You're just an unnamed powder ganger. Hi! What? What do you need done? Nothing's changed. Chavez won't answer to me, but he and this crew operate in my territory. Deal with them. I'll do it. Good. Chavez and his boys were last seen south of here. If you're lucky and he's careless, he might still be there. Where's Cook now? He and his crew went north. I heard talk about some sort of big plan to get back at the NCR, but haven't seen them since. Goodbye. Yeah, get out of here. Okay, now I was worried about... It says deal with Chavez, and I was like, well, I don't want to deal with Chavez. I'm playing a relatively good character, you know? So, but yeah, there's there's definitely ways. I didn't spoil it for myself, even though I do believe I've done this before, but I just don't remember whatsoever. Uh, there should be a way to do it without, you know, actually taking... Hey. Where, how the hell do you get out of this place? There we go. Uh, there should be a way to do it without taking care of Chavez, if you get my... Whoa. Boulder City. Hey, that's where we're... Oh, we're on the wrong quest. Duh. Okay, so I fought the law. Deal with Chavez. Where is Cha... Wait, what? Oh, he's like super duper close. I guess he said that. Okay. Uh, oh, is he literally right over... Oh, wow. I was... Okay, for some reason I was thinking he was in a completely different place. Uh, Chavez, where you at, my friend? Are you literally right here? That's not you. Door to mo... Okay, it's doing this weird thing where it like sends us through multiple doors. Alright, let's check where this guy's at now. Yeah, he's still in the same spot. Alright, he's just a short walk over this way. I have zero memory of this, but there is a way to do it without just, uh, you know, working for the dirty, dirty, disgusting, grotesquely awful powder gangers who are evil, evil, explosive men. Uh, there's some over there, by the way. Yeah, even if you're shunned, I think a lot of people thought we were uh, locked out of this quest, and that is not the case, friends. We're gonna be completing it, uh, and in a way that is not... Uh, evil which makes me very happy so looks like these are the people over here yeah i have zero memory of this so i don't know if i just haven't done it or what we're gonna go ahead and make a save here by the way a lot of criticisms and stuff well you know like constructive criticisms coming in for this playthrough uh as is usual for my series everybody wants me to play the way that they play you know that's just how it goes doing let's plays i'll talk about some of them if we have uh some extra time what is this read note powder ganger note the note reads, Some of the fellows farther north are trying to organize. We're starting to think it's a good idea. Gotta pool resources if we're gonna survive out here. Sure, you've noticed the decline in travelers. If they're getting wise, so should we. Can we take... Oh, we can just take their dynamite. We got a lot of stuff that we need to sell, though. We got Powder Ganger, we got Chavez, and we got Powder Ganger. Well, hello there, friend. 
You just walked into the wrong camp, my friend. Hand over everything you've got and we might let you live. Oh, you silly boy. No. <laughs> That's funny. Eddie sent me to deal with you. That's nothing new. Am I supposed to be impressed? And there we go. It's the magic ticket. I'm telling you, speech is just beautiful. A lot of people, by the way, said, GV, there's no reason to add charisma to your character. Look, man, I don't care much about special. I just like to make a special thing for, like, the character that I want to play. Let's be honest. This game ain't hard. Like, we're going to be able to get through it no matter what. So I just like creating a character, even if it presents challenges. That's why I gave him lots of uh, charisma. Eddie's just going to keep chasing you. Quit while you're ahead and alive. All right. Pickings were getting slim around here anyway. That was easy. Hey, look, and now everybody lives. Isn't that great? You know, Chavez, you look disgusting. Let me go ahead and grab a picture of your face real quick, if you don't mind. I mean, not disgusting. I should say uh, unique. Your face is a little wide is what I'm trying to say. There we go. You look so, uh, 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 well, it, you know, beauty's in the eye of the beholder. His eyes are a little bit off kilter there. Man comes okay, there we go. Thank you very much. Huh? That's what I thought. All right. got some new what? Over the town Just now. kidding. All right. Let's go back to the uh, NCR correctional facility. Powder Ganger camps. It, it says we're Never shunned, but unfortunately for... What? Oh, we went to... <laughs> Whoopsie-daisy. Uh, wait, no. We do need to... Oh, yeah. There we go. Guess I just accidentally traveled to the same place we were in. Okay, so that takes care of that. Hello. And now Eddie should... Got cold eyes. Definitely ex-military. Who? Oh, Boone? Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't get on Boone's bad side, y'all. Boone's actually pretty gosh darn tough when it comes down to hit the nail on the head, which makes no sense, but it's just something that I wanted to say. Uh, all right, so yeah, we, I don't really feel comfortable working for this slime ball, Eddie, but at the same time, it is 100% playthrough, so hopefully we'll be able to shift gears soon. Hi! What? Chavez have been dealt with. You won't see him around here anymore. I'm happy you cleared that up for me, but we've got another situation to worry about. There's a merchant hanging around near the prison. Something feels funny about him, and I want you to deal with him. Shake him down if he's legit, but if not, take him out. What exactly is funny about that merchant you want me to check out? Most people already know we run this territory and are usually in a hurry to get out. Not this guy. It's like he wants us to come get him. Goodbye. Yeah, get out of here. Hey, man, I'm working for you and I'm being nice. You don't have to be mean all the time, okay? All right, let's see. So we're working for him still. I fought the law. Track down the suspicious merchant and get rid of him. Yeah, man, again, just zero memory of this. Uh, I don't know what this suspicious merchant is going to be. I wonder if it's going to be somebody we've met before? I don't know. Either way, let's see where he's at. Okay, let's see. Let's take a look at our world map. Where are you at, Suspicious Merchant? He's closer to the good... Oh, man, he's, like, right next to Good Springs. That ain't good. Uh, we consider ourselves sort of a protect... Whoa! Nice job, Boone. Didn't even have to lift a finger. We're super close to, uh... Super close to another level up, by the way. Uh, so one of the things people have been saying is, like, GV, you're Russian, and they seem to always think that, you know, they think that I'm a Russian guy, and I'm actually, like, a Caucasian male living in the United States, so, no, just kidding. Uh, they seem to think that I rush through things. Let me just tell you what, I, that's just how I play games. It doesn't matter that I'm recording an episode for YouTube. Um, everybody always seems to think I'm rushing, I'm going through things too fast. It's just my style, man. What can I say? That's just how I do things. Uh... Yeah, I don't feel any need to rush, or I'm not trying to go through things quickly. It's just kind of how I play video games, especially ones that I've played through, you know, many, many, many times. Okay, we got the Traveling Merchant here. Let's save the game in case we royally mess things up. Hi there, pal. Better be careful around these parts. I hear there's powder gangers around and dangerous for merchants like me. Yeah, about that. Ooh, look at our options here. Okay. Uh, we can we can actually get him to pay us money. Yeah, that's not our character. Traveling a little light for a merchant, aren't you? No pack, Brahmin. A real merchant would be much more worried about powder gangers, you know? Uh, I mean, this one's going to be harder to go for, but... Yeah, let's go for this one, I guess. Traveling a little light for a merchant, aren't you? No pack, Brahmin. Well, you see, I... Fuck. I'm really a bounty hunter trying to catch some powder gangers. But they probably saw through me just like you did. I've been hanging around, hoping to ambush some of them, but haven't had any success. There's a bounty out on powder gangers? No, but there ought to be. I'm just taking the initiative, is all. That's 
an odd way to live your life, but okay. You think you can take the take on powder gangers by yourself? Not a whole gang or anything, just two, maybe three. I was a caravan guard, so I know how to handle a gun pretty well. Yeah, I don't remember ever talking to this guy, man. You better leave while you can. The powder gangers won't fall for your trick. Yeah, it was a stupid idea anyway. See you around. Okay, that was easy. Thanks, man. <laughs> Thanks for being so cordial. Uh, all right, let's go back to NCR Correction. Yeah, this quest is easy. I, I swear, man, I've never, I don't think I ever done this quest. I really don't. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm not rushing through it. I mean, I may be going fast for your tastes, you know, I understand that, but just know that I don't, I'm not trying to rush through the game. I'm not trying to do things quickly. I've just, you know, I've played these games so many times that, you know, I just, I, I, I speed things up a little, I guess. You know, if it was a game that I've never played before, maybe I'd go slower. Also, the accent, uh, it seems to be like, I would say, 75% enjoy it, 25% find it cringy or don't like it or whatever. I enjoy doing it, you know, I mean, this is New Vegas, it's all about role-playing, right? So, I, you know, we're gonna keep doing it, I'll try to keep honing it and making it better, but, uh, yeah, I like doing it. Hi! What? I got rid of him. Good. Had him figured for NCR, one of the rangers, maybe. Anyway, speaking of the NCR, I need you to take a walk down to Prim. The NCR hasn't raised hell over our breakout, and I want to find out why. They're up to something, I can feel it. What am I looking for in Prim? I know the NCR has troops near Prim, so talk to the locals and find out if any of those troops are going to be coming our way. Alright, I think we'll talk to him, like, get a little bit of his backstory. We should have been doing this, but we're gonna go through, like, one each time. We might, uh, lose out on this, but we might not have enough time to go through all these, but... How did you end up in this place? Why do you care? Answer, you shouldn't. I don't feel like trading life stories. Oh, okay. How did the breakout happen? It was all Cook's idea. He and his boys managed to swipe some dynamite and hide it away in their cells. The rest of us just tagged along. Cook's crew headed north while the rest of us stuck around for payback. What can you tell me about the prison? The NCR called it a work release prison. We lucky prisoners got the privilege of fixing up the rail lines and blasting rock for new lines. They got sloppy though. Some of us managed to hide away some dynamite and look who's in charge now. Ha! <laughs> That's cute, he thinks he's in charge, but actually I'm the one in charge. Man, I keep trying to say funny, like, one-liners, and it comes off just like, yeah, that didn't land so well, Juvie. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's see. Is there any other, uh, you know, feedback that I, I want to talk about as we're heading over to this, uh, heading over to Prim? Um, I think I covered most of it. You know, we're missing some, like, unique weapons and things, which is always the case for my playthroughs. Uh, I will try to go and pick them up. Let's see. One that was mentioned was the Cleaver, um, and then also one that was mentioned was the Lucky pistol which we're gonna need some lock pick for uh i'll try to keep her running like a notepad of all those and we will try to get them oh another thing is yeah these 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 drop boxes i don't know if it's this one but there's drop boxes that you can leave stuff in i i yeah i never knew that i guess i guess i just always use the player homes um yeah you know what i did i never use these drop boxes so is it these these mail drop boxes you can just leave stuff in i assume it is but i don't want to i don't know for sure right now so i'm gonna like research that uh, in between the next episode and make a uh, you know uh figure out for sure okay so let's see talk to the locals in prim and learn what if anything the ncr is planning for the correctional facility so we got two quest markers one leading into here where would this go i guess nash is in here oh yeah all right hello hey there youngster hi tommy lee jones I want to ask you some more about the... No. Do you know if the NCR is planning to attack the prison north of here? I might know something, but my memory ain't what it used to be. Sometimes it needs motivating. Disgusting, Nash. Really? I thought you were a better person than that. If the NCR won't deal with those prisoners, I'll have to risk doing it myself. Hold on there. With everything you've already done for this town, I'd feel ungrateful as hell if I let you risk yourself for no good reason. He made me swear not to say a word to no one, but an NCR deserter passed through some days ago and traded for supplies. According to him, the NCR has decided enough's enough and is going to send in a mess of troops to take back the prison any day now. Okay, that's what I thought, Nash. Thank you very much. Uh, goodbye. See ya. 
Ooh, now we're getting some options here. Oh, the last little bit of uh, feedback I wanted to talk about was... Um, I just literally forgot what it was. <laughs> Crap, what was it? Oh, man. Uh, it was something. Darn it. I don't remember now. All right, let's take a look at our options. Optional. Betray Eddie by offering Lieutenant Hayes assistance in retaking the prison. Report back to Eddie with information on the NCR's planned attacks. Well, I think you all know what we're going to be going for. Yeah, a lot of people seem to think that um, this quest was missable, but I think it's only if you... You can be shunned. I read something like, as long as you don't just attack anybody in the uh, correctional facility, you're, you'll still be good. So, yeah, if you do it the way that I'm doing it, just make sure not to, you know, attack the powder gangers, and you can still complete this quest. There you go. So we're going to go to Lieutenant Hayes over here. We're going to help him take the prison because, uh, yeah, our character doesn't really like the dirty, disgusting powder gangers. And I personally don't like them either. They're gross. I, I really severely dislike them. Hi. Yeah. I know the NCR is planning to attack the prison. Military operations are classified information. Classified or not, I want to help make them. I want to help make the attack. Some powder gangers did you wrong, is that it? Get in line. Still, you do look capable enough, and manpower hasn't been easy to come by. All right, fine by me if you want to put yourself in harm's way. I'll mark the staging area on your map. Talk to Sergeant Lee. Yeah, I don't think I. I know I keep. I know I'm a broken record. I don't think I literally ever did this quest. This is so weird. This, this has got to be like one of the only quests I've never done. Okay, where is this Sergeant Lee? Probably near the correctional facility, I would say. Yep, looks like it. Um, let's go to this one, and we'll meet him halfway. I don't know if they're going to attack me on site. I might be known as a traitor now, but this is going to be good. Uh, we're going to get some revenge. Yeah, pow I mean, dude, it's a gang. It's literally a gang using dynamite. So I'm going to be happy to take them out. Uh, they are terrorizing the people of this wasteland, and let's be honest, dude, There's there's been enough. There's been enough, like, sadness and bad things going around. We don't need more due to the gro- Oh, now I remember. Yeah, it's the, um, it's the, uh, the experience perk that we take. Everybody hates it when I take that perk. Uh, there's probably a good reason for it, but, you know, I just always do it. It's a force of habit, and whatever. I, you know, it's just what I like to do, but every time I take that perk in any Fallout playthrough, everybody always gets on my case. It, it's done, you know, it is what it is, so let's Even. move on. Hi! I'm Sergeant Lee. Lieutenant Hayes radioed ahead to say you were on the way. We've got surprise on our side, and that's about it. Once we blow a gap in the fence, we've got to pour on the fire and keep them disorganized. Our goal is to take out their leader, some assbag named Eddie. With the ringleader gone, the rest will fold. And that's all the briefing you're going to get. Let's go. Sounds good to me. Yeah, but man, this is totally new to me. Kill Eddie. You got it. Let's take out that scumbag. Ooh, okay. Harder to aim, I'm realizing now, on this bed. Is that Eddie right there? Yeah, really hard to aim. I'm gonna have to... Am I even hitting this guy? Can't tell if I'm hitting him or not. Is that Eddie? We got Boone, and yeah, I guess our perception's too low to be able to look at him. I don't know if I'm hitting him or not, so let's try to enter the uh, facility, I suppose. Uh, we, we, I mean, I feel, I feel kind of unstoppable right now. We got, like, a, a lot of ammo. We got a lot of energy rounds. Let's do this. Let's try to get a lead. Well, we'll just follow the quest marker. Yeah, I guess that's not Eddie, since we have a quest marker. Okay, hello, hello, fellas. We're gonna make copious use of vats here, since we're gonna have a lot of different people. I wonder if it's good going for the head. With energy weapons, I'm not really sure. Nude, completely new to the energy weapons, as I keep saying. Okay, let's make sure to loot these guys for any and all ammo we may or may not need. Nine millimeter rounds. Let's see. Yeah, we don't have too much uh, carry weight left. Bobby pin. Okay, what do we have here? Ooh, okay, lots of stuff. Yeah, so we're gonna take. So this stuff weighs nothing. Greyjoy saying hi over here to my right, <laughs> rubbing his head against my feet. Uh, we're going to take these uh, these ammo shells because they weigh nothing. We can convert them into ammo, which, yeah, is something that I need to get used to. Just uh, don't usually pick up trash, but uh, it is something that you just want to do. So we are going to take it. 
Uh, yeah, all right, let's see. Let's just go straight for Eddie, I think. We can try to clear out the rest, but, uh, ooh, there's our level up. Can we do it now? No, we're gonna have to, um, okay, let's make a new save, just in case there's more quests here that I've messed up and should have done. It looks like there's only one, so hopefully, yeah, hopefully there is only one. I'm not sure, though. Oh, you're gonna come at me, ha you're gonna come at me with a knife? That's cute. Oh, I thought you were still alive, pal. Ooh, and you got two stim packs for me. Thank you very much. Uh, all right, let's reload real quick. Where are you at, Eddie? You can't hide, buddy. Yeah, your days of terrorizing the wasteland are over. Hate to tell you. Hope you had fun while you were doing it, though. Gaining karma while murdering people, always a good combo. Oh my god, here they come. Okay, let's reload, let him take the brunt of the attack. Oh man, we got Scrambler. Well, a an apt name because your brains are gonna be scrambled. See, I always try to do one ladders, so they just come flat, I'm so sorry. <laughs> nice view on every Avery there. Oh no, are we vilified with the powder gangers? Oh man, if only there were like no powder gangers left. For your overwhelmingly monstrous behavior, you have become vilified by the community. It's okay, I really don't want to be a part of that community anyways. Okay, and here we have level eight. Let's see what we got. Uh, I think I was trying to get science and lockpick up to, you know, probably get lockpick like way up there, right? Uh, energy weapons also would be good. Um, you know, let's get energy weapons up to 50, and let's do lockpick just, like, up to, like, the max, I think. Yeah, we want to get that stuff going as soon as possible. Okay, now we can get some interesting, uh, perks here. What do we got? Terrifying presence. Uh, yeah, we can, you can intimidate people. We're not gonna do that, though, because I don't, yeah, I, I don't, I don't like that. I don't want to just, like, send people away immediately. Uh, sneering imperialist. This one's weird. Kindly to raiders, junkies, or tribals. Oh man, <laughs> that's super xenophobic. Zion's tribals do 15% damage and have a bonus to hit in vats. Sounds pretty good. What else we got? Scrounger, more ammo, commando, uh, rifle. Your accuracy in vats is significant. I don't know if that applies to energy weapons though. That's the thing. Not sure. Uh, pistol, same thing. We don't use pistols though. Fortune finder, more caps and containers. Eh, I'm not sure if that perk's good or not. Ferocious Loyalty. When you drop below 50% health, your companions temporarily gain much greater resistance to damage. Ah, uh, jeez, that would be good for keeping them alive, but I don't know if I want to do companion perks, because I detest companions, even though we're going to have to use them for the 100%. Uh, Bloody Mess. We get a 5% extra crit, uh, extra damage with everything, which is the good thing, and also everybody explodes more. The Running Gun perk reduces accuracy penalties with one-handed guns and energy weapons while walking or running. Ah, uh, that could be good. Uh, you gain two more skill points every time you advance in level. This perk is best taken early. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's the perk everybody likes. Um, comprehend. You know what? We're just going to go for that. I'm sorry we have such boring perks right off the bat, but I'm trying to maximize stuff. So we're going to go for educated. Yeah. So with the educated perk, you gain two more skill points every time you advance in level. This perk is best taken early on to maximize its effectiveness. Sounds good to me. Okay. We good, guys? Going to have a lot of bodies here to loot. Let's see. We're not going to be able to take too much stuff. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We got... It's hard. Uh, now we gotta do the thing that's always a challenge in uh, Fallout and Elder Scrolls games. Trying to... Okay, can you watch out, please? Trying to uh, loot the stuff. Trying to loot the bodies in a gigantic pile of death. Uh, who else we got? We got this guy. Thank you. We got... Oh, here's Eddie. Administration key. Bottle cap, drain, microfusion cells, energy. Look at this guy. He gets his own plasma pistol. Isn't he cool? How much does this weigh? Alright, we'll take it. Uh, then we got some other fellas over here, don't we? Uh, do we loot this guy? Good. And we got this guy here. Okay. I think that's everybody. I thought there was one more, like, uniquely named guy. Yeah, here. Hannigan. I guess we looted him already. Um, okay. I think we're done. We're gonna go ahead and end this episode here, ladies and gentlemen. I have no idea if we're, like... Uh, short on time or if we're going over on time not that it's a really a big deal but just want to make sure um, this video isn't too long because then the upload process starts getting a little a little a little crazy not too bad but anyways 
We're going to end this episode here, ladies and gents, and finish this quest off in the next one. Thank you so, so much for watching. Thank you so, so much for just saying nice things. Uh, this playthrough has been so well received, and I'm very, very happy about that. So, thank you very much, everybody. I hope you're enjoying... Well, it seems like people are enjoying watching this. But, yeah, keep, keep with the feedback, with the constructive criticism. I will uh, take it into account if I agree that, you know, it'll make the playthrough better. Uh, so, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you to my patrons, and thank you to everybody. Bye-bye.